Hi guys, welcome back to another video and today I'll be showing you guys the YouTube keychain I got. So real quick before I get started here, I literally tried a Thried. I literally tried recording three videos today and all three of them messed up and this is my third one actually okay all three of them didn't mess up I'm assuming this one's gonna mess up but I recorded two videos before this one was like 20 minutes long it was a survival mode match with a noob weapon I was just trying to prove that you could win survival mode without having to uh, do something too crazy here let me adjust my lighting here I got like a dark spot on my left eye so it looks like I have a black eye for no reason but anyways I really lost like three uh, good good content videos and i'm like damn okay so okay i'm spitting all over the place geezing out on you guys it's crazy okay so the first video it was like 20 minutes i tried to record it and i tried to put this uh face recording on the video and it wouldn't work it was like three gigabytes big and it was like it wouldn't process for some reason and then i recorded a video without my face and I forgot to turn the audio on on my screen recorder so it was just gameplay and then I was considering putting music on it but I was doing pretty terrible in that video it was a Sega review and I kind of needed to talk in a review so I was like I don't know how this is gonna turn out either so then I went ahead and recorded a how to remove the background in my other channel if you want to see how to do that in like three minutes it was so so simple I'm probably gonna have that thumbnail on here anyways uh go check that out it's super simple it's completely for free on Android devices I don't know if it's on iOS or, or not please don't fight about Android versus iOS in the comment section it's just not worth it guys um but anyways today we're gonna be looking at the best keychain in the game and that's the youtube keychain it looks absolutely gorgeous i'm actually surprised that it was real a lot of people told me it was real like three months ago and i went and saw melvin's and i was like this is amazing it looks so uh, gorgeous so i have them for all my guns as you can see i have it on my sega right now and i have one on my mp155 i have one on my chris yes i'm just gonna choose this video for <laughs> a few times so um yeah and then bison p90 all right i'm gonna stop now but all honesty uh i had that and it is absolutely gorgeous and really nice to have i'm curious though if you drop a weapon and you die if the opponent picks it up did they get the youtube keychain do they i i, I have no idea but i'm super super curious about that uh and yeah so let's get right into the review of the sega before i get into the review though I got the Sega silencer in a standard chest. That was absolutely fantastic. Timing literally couldn't have been better. I was coming up on the Sega. I did the Spas review yesterday and I was gonna do the Sega review today and I was like, I don't have enough money to buy both the silencer and the fast clip. And then I got the silencer in the bag, in the bag, in the box and I got the fast clip with my own money, but perfect timing. Thank you. Thank you, big man. Um, but. Anyway, let's get right into it. Fully modified Sega looks absolutely gorgeous. I don't have a sight on there. I wouldn't recommend putting a sight on the Sega. It's just not worth this super, super close distance weapon. Um, but looking at the stats of this weapon, fully modified, it has the stats of 167 damage, accuracy of 198, fire rate of 3.1, holder of eight rounds in total ammo of 30 now i tried a game with this earlier as i said for my other review video uh and i did terrible so maybe it's a good thing that the video didn't work out also if you're saying wow this man's hair is crazy yes i woke up i tried to record videos didn't work out but i didn't get to shower yet my beard's all crazy my hair is all crazy don't mind that good thing this isn't a beauty channel because it would be a disaster so yeah, really nice stats. Let's look at the customizations of this weapon. We have four skins for this weapon. We have the gorgeous one. That's the first one. And I don't know why that's the normal skin. Really, luxuri really luxurious. luxurious. Uh, it has a nice padding on the grip. And it has gold lining, which looks absolutely fantastic. And then we have these ugly ones that are rares and legendaries. I don't know why the nicest one is a normal. And the rest of them are like rares and legendaries so the leg i also have the legendary one which is a yellow and gray one and then two rares one is blue and green the other one is this really nice is uh really nasty zombie looking one moving on to sights as i said i would not recommend putting sights on this gun super close distance it's the least accurate shotgun of all the shotguns so You'd kind of be wasting money if you put a sight on here. The only reason I would advise putting a sight on here is if you want your weapon to look complete, if you want it to look fully modified. 
Moving over to trunks, this weapon has three trunks. I have two of the three. I would only recommend putting the silencer on here. Silencer increases damage, decreases accuracy, but you really don't need accuracy for shotguns. Even a shotgun like this, if you're close distance and you're using it properly, you should do absolutely fantastic with it you really don't need a silencer or a compensator or a suppressor for this gun moving on over to lights and lasers i would recommend once again putting on the damage boosting effect uh customization which is the flashlight and uh really does help out a lot increases damage by 11 and accuracy by Moving over to clips, this weapon has a really nice magazine of 8 rounds you can get from 4 to 8 kills from closer distances and like 1 kill over longer distances. Um, but yeah, I would recommend putting the fast clip on here because it increases that kill speed and really, really helps you out. And then keychains, obviously I have my secret keychain. We have the YouTube keychain which looks adorable. Looks absolutely crazy. Uh, and then finally, if you want to put a counter on there, which I would recommend because this is a really good gun, um, go ahead and do that. Um, but yeah, let's get right into the game without any further ado. Also, if you are looking to buy or customize weapons, definitely go check out my videos, my playlist. They'll help you out a lot. They'll help you save money. They'll help you save rage. And you'll be happy with me and you'll thank me. You'll be like, oh my God, he's so amazing. He's so cute. Oh my God, he looks so ugly in this, <laughs> this video. <laughs> but anyway, let's get right into this game. Let's test our beautiful, beautiful Sega. Oh, one second. Let's uh, equip medkit because I, I'll probably die way too quickly without this. Currently have a uh, ammo pack because I was in survival mode, which, which didn't work out either. But let's get right into it. I'm just gonna sit here and smile at you until it starts up. Is it creepy? Is it weird? Uh, anyways, um, yeah, we are in. Kaboom did not want me to keep smiling at you. I might, um, oh my god, I might get demonetized for some sexual harassment or something for smiling at you guys. I hope that doesn't happen. I'm trying to be nice. All right, here we go. We got captured the point. Oh my God, bad start off, hide. Wow, horrible, horrible start. I got killed with the SR3 by John Cena. You know why I got killed by him? Because he was invisible and I couldn't see him. <laughs> Get it, John Cena joke, John Cena joke. All right, um, let's move in and try to get some actual kills now. Um, boop, 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 boop. Nice, headshot. Ooh, took off his head. I should do some stuff like Mr. Captain Awesome where I do memes. Um, but I'm more of a voiceover type of guy. His content is super funny. Super funny. I don't know why I'm shouting out a compet competing YouTuber, but hey, it's okay. I like If I like your content, I will definitely give you a shout out. But please, please, if you are a small YouTuber, um, don't ask me to view the content. It just draws the wrong, the wrong crowd for my channel. I don't want any uh, type of subscribers that come here uh, to exchange views or subscriptions. I just want people who enjoy my content. And uh, that way, we could all have fun. And we can't. Uh, we don't come here to write coattails. Okay. Um, but yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that thumbs up button. If you like this type of content in general, hit that subscribe button as well as the post notification bell. I don't know where this came from, but it's seeming to stick and I like it. So anyways, I'll see you in my next video and until then, have an amazing, amazing day.